So the other night, um, I had a dream and there was a water fountain that was so beautiful and it was in the middle of a pool but it was tall enough to resemble like a shower and so it just reminded me that Jesus is the living water and he is a fountain of eternal life and joy and the pool reminded me of the baptism and the filling of the Holy Spirit covering us, washing over us and the, the fountain in the middle being tall enough to resemble a shower was a symbol of Jesus washing over us and washing away our sins. And it was interesting in my dream that I was sitting there enjoying the pool and enjoying the fountain and um, just enjoying its beauty, which in my dream it was much more beautiful <laughs> than this picture in front of me. but. Um, I was just sitting there relaxing and enjoying the beauty of the Lord and the Holy Spirit and the filling of the Spirit and Jesus and His presence. But there was another couple there, and they enjoyed the beauty of the fountain for a while, but then they kind of just became um, anxious to get to the next thing, and so they left to go catch an elevator. Um, and I think sometimes that can represent going up, like in the rapture. And so we don't want to get too caught up, brothers and sisters, in looking for our blessed hope, the appearing of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, that we forget His presence is here with us now, that we can enjoy His presence. And I think sometimes we forget that um, because of the cessationist movement that doesn't always allow for the fullness of the Holy Spirit presence to manifest itself. And um, I was just thinking another, another word for cessationist might be suppressionist, but um, we just need to pray that the Lord will lead us to places where the Holy Spirit um, is free to move. And there's been a handful of times in my life where the, the tangible presence of the Holy Spirit um, is so much more than just talking about it or reading it or believing it. And so I think that's why a lot of us these days get anxious for the rapture to come and we want to be in the eternal presence of our Lord um, because it's not always real tangible here on earth um, in the places we find ourselves. Mm. So, God bless you, brothers and sisters. Continue to sit in the presence of the Lord and enjoy His peace, His tender, gentle touch, His love.